Growing cluster of COVID-19 cases in Provincetown has resulted in drastic action from the town select board. In a joint emergency meeting with Provincetown Board of Health last night, the select board voted unanimously to adopt an indoor mask mandate within indoor public spaces effective immediately. 12 News reporter Alexander Leslie joins us now. Alex, this comes not too long after the town had issued this uh, mask advisory. Yes, yeah, so that advisory was issued was issued only about a week ago. As of July 16th, the town reported 132 positive COVID cases associated with that Provincetown cluster. As of last Friday, that climbed to 430 cases, with a majority of those being Massachusetts residents. The town also reports about 71% of cases among Massachusetts residents in this cluster are found to be predominantly symptomatic, with 69% of affected individuals fully vaccinated. Town officials say there are three associated hospitalizations, two in state and one out of state. But apart from those cases, symptoms are known to be mild and without complication. Town manager Alex Moore says if there is a test positivity rate below 3% for at least five days, the mandate will shift back to an advisory. And if under 1% for at least five days, that advisory will be lifted. Indoors is, is again where the I think the danger is, the transmission is. We're prepared to take further action if the positivity rate doesn't decline. A town, ma town manager Morse did note while contact tracing and testing continues to identify cases associated with that July 4th cluster, the town's daily positivity rate, while still high, has dropped from 15% down to 9%. Live in studio, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.